Yo, what's your boy? What's up, y'all? Welcome to the channel. Um, today, we got something special. Uh, gonna just take out the diffuser today. Try to do a diffuser delete on my G. Other than that, it looks pretty nice. I uh, wanted to take away the diffuser there. These, and just remove them. Uh, it'll probably look hella aggressive. You guys let me know in the comment section below what you think. You know, if it's aggressive. Not a lot of people do this on the G's, but you see them on the Z's. Um, but, you know, a lot of people do it on the Z's, but not on the G's that often. And I'm, since I'm going for the single exit exhaust route, um, I think it'll look aggressive. This bumper is not gonna be like, it's not gonna be my final bumper. I'm getting like a cool, way better rear bumper. Um, so, what you're gonna need is this little rotary tool. I got this from Harbor Freight. So if you guys wanna need a rotary tool or anything, go to Harbor Freight. This was nine dollars. Uh, they're on sale now. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be the only price now. Comes with basically everything you'll you'll need. Yeah, Harbor Freight has these. I'll probably try to put a link in the description below for these. But yeah, this is what we're gonna use today. Uh, yeah. If you guys are new, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you're new. Crazy content coming on. Crazy, crazy content we got coming through with the squad, everybody. Um, I try to get as much videos out as I can. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do a whole bunch of videos, so stay tuned. You guys will enjoy, smash that like button. Uh, kinda new to this stuff, you know, if there's things you would like for me to improve on, let me know. I'll, I'll take everything from you guys. Comment down below. I like to hear you guys' feedback. Let's get to it. Uh, so you're gonna need the safety glasses because the, the sparks are gonna like start shooting everywhere, like from the bumper. I got it set up. If you guys want me to show you how to like put it on, let me know. It's pretty, it's kind of simple. You think about it. Put the glasses on, and we're gonna get to it. I don't want to take the exhaust off. That's too much of a hassle. I don't have jacks right now to do it, so I'm just gonna do it like that. And we're just gonna get through it. Let's go. These things start shooting at you, man. They, sh they hurt, man. Ain't no turning back now, bro. Let's get to it. This is a Chucky Beat production. production. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, yeah, I had, to I had to turn the car around uh, just because it's cooler here. Uh, so you might, I don't know if you see this, but this, this I have oil leak, so there's oil production. leak on in the garage. I, I, I can get rid of it, but that's not the point. So um, the Dremel that I got, wow, it just broke. I guess I, I dropped it in the crack, but uh, I can just get another bit. Um, it's been taking a long time. It's I've been two hours, including breaks and everything. But what I found to be more easy, I'm gonna have to smooth it out. Maybe like this weekend, cause there's like some rough parts. There's like some rough parts. Um, but what I'm gonna use was uh, this scissors. It's like a, it's like a cutting scissors, really, really strong. This like the scissors is like really strong. I don't know the type, but 
if you guys know this type of scissors yet, this is what I was using. Wait, ah. God damn it. Yeah, this type of scissors I was using. Um, I used a bit and then I used a flathead. I don't know where the flathead is, but I was using a flathead too. Like, kind of like poke at it to like, like try to get it as thin as I could. Because the rotary kit, this rotary tool, um, it takes a long time. You gotta be really, really patient when you're doing this shit. But um, I, I used the rotary tool on that side, but on this side it was kind of tough. And this rotary tool isn't powerful enough, so when you're going in, it'll start like turning off, and then when you let go, it comes back on. So I didn't have the patience. So now this tool that I'm using is really, really strong. You just all I gotta do is just bam, and it just. I should have this out in no time, but let's get to it. Oh, and for those of you guys asking how come I didn't just remove the lighting plate, for some reason, like, one, you G owners that, you know, understand what I understand, like, the, what holds the license plate, the little sockets, I don't know what you call it, where the screw goes in, it's so, it's bad, and I just never got around to buy, like, a, a new one. But it, this is just gonna go for now. So that's, how it's been, that's how it's been, and that's how it's gonna be for a while until I just decide to actually buy one to so it can stay there. But it's it's down. We just get it, and we we'll should be out. I'm kind of scared now because I, I have a feeling it might not look as good as I thought. But uh, if not, it's still it it should look okay. Pretty nice. I might have to smooth in these parts out, but it looks okay. It looks pretty nice. It looks real nice. Oh, let me, all right, let me hurry up and get the other side. This is a Chucky Beat production. 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 Ooh, that looks nice. That looks nice. This is a Chucky Beat production. Alright, let's see if I can zoom out. Sorry guys. But it looks pretty nice. Ah, that looks good. Uh yeah, that it looks aggressive. What I would want to do now is probably put like a diffuser under here. That would make it look real nice. Uh, and I like how aggressive it looks. I'm gonna probably clean up. I'm gonna try to like clean it up, make it look smoother. Um, but let me move it up so you guys can see how it looks. It looks nice though. Alright guys, uh, so this is how it looks. Let's try to brighten it up a little bit for you 
guys but look it looks really nice with the single exit uh this is this single exit is not going to be the final exhaust um i'm getting uh probably not trying to stay away from the tomei clout train so but i'm going to get a single exhaust that's way better than the tomei you guys will like it uh this it was for a budget it's supreme uh i wanted bride or something that car related but yeah, this will do for now um, you guys let me know what you think do you like it this and that if you got questions I'm oh, sorry if you got questions let me know in the comment section below it's pretty nice it looks it looks pretty good now what will make it look even more aggressive is it like a Voltex a Voltex or a Voltex or a um, what will make it even way more cool if just imagine a Voltex, like an Evo Voltex diffuser there, or just a 370Z diffuser there, that'll make it look like really, really nice. But, uh, let me see. Uh, alright. Yeah, so, uh, sorry. I'm trying to get used to this camera. But you guys let me know what you think. Um, comment down below. Uh, you know, it's not your taste. You fuck with it. Let me know. So if you guys fuck with it, if not, let me know. Um, like I said, this is only temporary. Um, so honestly, I like it. It's pretty cool. It's a little different, um, especially with the single exhaust. It looks fucking nice. And the um, toe strap, it looks nice. R race car-ish. Um, you guys just let me know what you think. Um, yeah, smash that like button. Comment. Just let me know what you think. Um, let me know what videos I should do. Because uh, there's going to be a lot coming soon. Peace. See you guys in the next video.